What's up, everybody? It's your friendly neighborhood. Hug Knuckles back again with another reaction video. As always, by my side, Hot Sam. Hot Hi, Sam. Man. And today is a huge day for us. For us. Because there is a and new Jolly Bee commercial out. We're getting into the Quentong series yet again. <laughs> uh, if y'all didn't know, we're a huge Jolly Bee fans. But dink. But dink. But dink. Over there. I get messed up when I'm pointing behind us. Yeah. Uh, and I had my birthday party at Jollibee in the Philippines. And we love Jollibee and we crave it like, all the time. I really um, want some right now. I'm actually editing a video right now. Uh, me and Sam took my parents to Jollibee for the very first time. We went to Chicago uh, a couple months back. And it was if y'all didn't remember that. So I'm editing Same that video way. now. It should be out soon. But it's we were, I was watching us order it and I'm like, oh, I freaking want some spicy chicken. I know. We need to make um, that three-hour drive, like, really, like, or, soon. Or uh, Jollibee uh, San Antonio location, Austin location. Austin, San Marcos uh, location. San Marcos We're location. Right now. It's really <laughs> yeah. small town, We're totally down. Work. I mean, um, I'll, oh, I'll run it. Like, I can manage. I'll run it. <laughs> I'll run I'll, it. I'll, I'll like, sit there and eat food and be happy. Yeah. All right, but let's get into this and see what's going down. <sighs> We've been waiting. Are you ready? I'm ready. I don't want to cry. Hopefully this is like Inspired a Inspired by ending. a true story, as always. Yeah, please no one die. I know. Let's let this one Please no one die. But they've had a lot of happy ones, so I bet yeah. this one's going to be a sad one. Christmas, Christmas gift. Cool Where is that building? It looks familiar. Yeah. I think that's Dubai. I'm not sure. She's no FW. Mm. Yeah. So every year they send Christmas gifts home. Oh man, he started like. Crazy. 
I was like controlling myself for a bit. Nothing like actual footage of families meeting their family again. Yeah. Wow. My Aww. young Pasco. My young Pasco. I love everybody. Trolley Bean. <laughs> Alright. A little messed up here. We're alright. Alright. Oh. Let's still look at me for a minute. Well. I was I was fine. I was getting I was like <laughs> yeah, keeping your it voice together. Voice broke when you said actual footage. I was keeping it together. I was keeping <laughs> your it together. Voice broke. You I was <laughs> I was keeping it together. I was like, all right, I can do this. I can handle this. And then as soon as they showed the actual footage, like inspired by a true story is one thing. You already know that it's like a real thing. And especially you know we, I mean. If y'all watch this channel, chances are if you're a subscriber, you've already seen us. You know we are pretty well embedded into Filipino culture. Like, that's yeah. that's what we're about. So a lot of our fans, a lot of you, are OFWs. And yeah. some of you are missing your family right now. A and I know you're you probably crying along with us watching this. Tell us about it in the this. comments and stuff. And, and I know, like, you relate a lot to this. And a lot of you. Because you've told me. As somebody who, you know, I don't live in a different country than my family. But I live over a thousand miles away from my family. I can't just go there. Uh, if I want to see them, it's not like they live down the street. Like, I feel that I am away from my family a lot, especially yeah. the holidays and stuff. Christmas is coming up. I won't be home. Thanksgiving, I wasn't home. Um, so it's like, I definitely, I think that's why it relates to me. Yeah. Like, when I see actual footage of families come back together, I'm like, man, I remember, you know, whenever we go back home and I see my family for the first time and it's been like that a feeling. year. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I couldn't imagine being away for as long as they were. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because there was like, just like a lot of uh, boxes, you know, for me uh, every Christmas. And yeah. And it's that's like, years, that's why like, it hit me even harder at that point. Yeah. Like, I was already like at the, at the edge and I'm like, I can do this. Exactly. <laughs> you know, just like hold it in. But as soon as you, you see like that real like emotion and like mm -hmm. you understand that struggle, like yeah. it's just insane. And I also like, I feel like a lot of our, our, our fan, like our, our viewers, a lot of you like, you know, from the Philippines, like we love you so much. And it's like for you to have, like, we're actually like, this is kind of like us seeing that struggle that you have mm -hmm. as well. Um, and it's just like, I want you to be able to be home with your families, and it makes me just so sad, you know? And like, I want everybody to be able to, like, be together, and, like, I, I don't know. I just, there, I want you to be able to spend the holidays have, with your family. There's a lot of people that have shared stories with us about missing their yeah. family on the holidays, and it's, like, heartbreaking. I get so attached to you guys. Like, yeah. I just, I don't know. I want everybody to be happy. I think it's also the fact that, like, we know that the ho what what the holidays mean for family and connection and like that's the hardest time to be away and it's weird because it's like you know it's just another Thursday or just another Friday yeah but it's like it means so much and it mean it, it represents that togetherness and it's like it's so hard to be away on those holidays and you know we've heard of people when we when we went to Jolly Bee. Just talking about how they're OFWs and haven't been able to go because they don't have one where they're at yeah. for years. And they're like, watching this has let us kind of relive something in our life. Especially like when we did the vlogs, when we went to the Philippines. Like a lot yeah. of people um, were so happy for us just to be able to be there and experience it because they miss it so yeah. much. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's and like, that's why I think it's really great too that Jollibee is like all over. It's not just in the Philippines that way. You know, like people can can go and they can have that piece of home. And it's like, like I'm not from the Philippines, but like whenever I go to Jollibee, like I feel like I'm back there again. You know what I mean? It's like, mm -hmm. it's just so like for you know for them growing like you know growing up and then having to move away and and work you know out of the country. It's just like it's that piece and of be home something and that it's, they have to it's do, something you know? that yeah, and it's something that they can. Um, like, they can relate to, like, they can, not relate to, like, something that, like, I'm all messed up. Like, they can, it brings them back home, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, yeah, I get that. It's like a little piece of them that they can have, you know? It's like when uh, we found a place that had Italian beef. 
yeah. out here because that's like a very Chicago yeah. thing. Or deep um, dish pizza, which nobody does it right nobody down does here, just saying. Yeah, but Texas also people does say, not do deep dish pizza right. People also say that U.S. Jollibee is very different than the Philippines Jollibee, it which is. I'd kind of I, agree I'll with. I'll say that. That is very true. Um, I feel Things like, are different sizes. I feel like the too. one in Houston was different than the one in Skokie. Yeah, in Chicago. Chicago. Yeah. So, which you'll see very soon. Um, if you're so, excited yeah, for that spoiler video, alert, let us know. Sorry. If you're excited <laughs> I say to see, that in the vlog. If but. you're excited to see mom and dad knuckles first time at jollibee let us know in the comments because i want to yeah. know how many people actually want to see their first time at jollibee yeah um and it's also we eat it again so i mean yeah. who doesn't want to see us Which, eat it again we actually changed our minds yeah we, a couple we, things we, not gonna say what it is okay, don't spoil sorry uh, don't spoil I'm so messed up right but now. we actually changed our mind for the good on something yes and i want more I want more so bad. <laughs> I want it so bad. I'm so like, like I, that rice with gravy and chicken joy right now would be. Also the thing that, well, I mean, I'm kind of getting off into it, but like we don't get the rice diaper in the U.S. Yeah. I was kind of spoiled. When we went to That's, the Philippines, we get our rice in the rice diaper. Yeah, we call, we call it the, the rice wrapper. diaper. And but here it's just like, oh, it's in a cup. It looks like a little burger, you know? Yeah. It's what we call the rice diaper. And then, yeah, they give it to us in a little cup. I was like, this I'm is like, not sufficient. I need my rice my diaper. Rice cup? My um, rice diaper, I mean. So, what I want to do for our next trip to Jellybee, we've been to Houston. We've been to one of the Chicago locations. We went with Mom and Dad Knuckles. You know, we went ourselves. We ate with Jellybee. Oh, we saw the other. In the Philippines. We, we saw in both Jellybee locations, but we just only went to one. Yeah. Also, we saw uh, Red Ribbon, but we didn't go. Um, I want to go to the other location when we go back to see my parents again, but I want to take my sister and her family. Yes. And, uh, but for our next location that I want to go, and this might be a long shot, it might be something we'd have to set up a way to do it. Um, I don't know how we, we do this or whatever, but I want to go to a different location. I want to go to a different community and you know see what, what it's like. I want to go to Vegas. Do. You want to go to Vegas? I want to go to the Vegas location because there's a red ribbon there. Um, there's a Jollibee and we have and quite a, a few Goldilocks. people. Well, there, but there isn't. Goldilocks is a comp competitor, but they yeah. are good. I'm not yeah. going to, I'm not going to sit here and say they're not yeah. good. They're good. Cause, uh, we had a friend of ours sent us some stuff from Goldilocks. Isn't but, there like a chow, the chow, uh. Oh yeah. Isn't there? Or are those all in California? Yeah. But anyway, Pierre is there. We yes. have, we have a, a long time, uh, friend of the channel, uh, Pierre, who, as a graphic designer and stuff, he does. He's been very active in the channel for a long time, but he lives out there, and I would love to go to Jelly Bee with him. So if you yes. watch this video, I want to go to Jelly Bee with yeah. you. Yeah. But I would also like kind of like to do a meetup. Yeah. I think it'd be really I cool. Wanna, I want to. I also want to do one in, one in Seattle. I want to go to one in Seattle because I, I want Seattle. to meet a Dobo sandwich, mm -hmm. and I want to eat a Jolly Bee with a Dobo sandwich. The only problem with that is it's like double the distance. So I was like, oh, that's where I would like to go from the that's next one. That's a long one. drive. Yeah, that's where I would that's like to go for the next one but i think it's too far to be a reality at least yeah. yet yeah vegas is already a long shot but we could maybe make that possible i think that's a one day drive instead of a two day vegas yeah. is yeah it's about a one day but it'd be like, like a full day a full day yeah like i don't know. sleep like if you're interested at all in us going to other locations let care. us know in the comments down below as well um i just think it'd be fun i personally what i wanted to do is go to every jelly bee location in the u.s that would be legit. I wanted to do like a road trip, but that would be something we'd have to like, I don't know, we'd get sponsored for out. and whatever, because we couldn't just leave our lives. I'm going to go to like that. the one in Jersey and the one. We want to go to all of them. Yeah. Where all are they? There's like. There's a lot in California, Seattle. They're, they're sprinkled. Lord. I think there's one in Louisiana. I'm not sure. Really? I think there was. It might be. Anyway, yeah, all of them. I think I'm there was go one in New all. Orleans or whatever. But I want to do a road trip. I want a road trip across the country and go to different Jollibees. And what I wanted to do was meet the people in the communities. Yes. I because think that's that what's be... huge to me. Yes. I don't know. If any of this makes any sense to you, if you like any of it at all, <laughs> let us know in the comments down below. Like it if you did. <coughs> Sub if you don't. <laughs> um, and I don't know. Like... This is this has been awesome. This, this is great. Really it was a happy ending. Yep. Nobody died. It was a happy ending. Nobody. It was a happy um, ending. Nobody uh, had anything terrible happen to them. It was a good time. Yes. Um, it was all good in the hood. Yep. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, Melody and, and really Pasco. Want... Yeah. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>
you're just staring at me like. I want Jollibee now. <laughs> He's really dead. 